Hello. I'm going to teach you a three minute yoga break. If anyone wants to join, if you're working at home, take a little break, get up from your desk. If you're sitting on the couch and being inactive, get up and join me, stretch and move. If you can't do the standing versions, you can do it seated in a chair or a wheelchair. So start with your feet together, close your eyes, take a few slow deep breaths in mountain pose. Just take a moment to balance the weight on both feet, getting centered in the body, becoming aware of the breath, and feeling the feet on the ground. As you slow the breath down, join the fingers together, fingers interlocked, breathe in. Interlock the fingers, stretch the arms up for palm tree pose. Your legs are like the tree trunk and the arms are the branches. And then a little swaying palm tree or crescent moon. Curve to the side and hold and breathe. And then switch. And breathing in, stretch the arms up. Breathing out, lower down. And then now same thing, interlock the fingers, stretch up. And now lift the heels up, squeeze the thighs together, hold and balance. Go way up on the tippy toes. Hug the arm bones towards the ears, navel to spine. Thighs hug in. I know that's not as easy as it looks, but do your best. When you come out, lower the heels, lower the arms, and shake it out. Okay, good. Now you're going to interlock your fingers behind you. Lift the heart, breathe in. Bend the knees, exhale, folding. Knees bent, chest towards thigh. Stretch the arms up and hold. If the shoulders feel tight, wiggle them a little side to side. When you want to come out, hands on the floor, and then walk it forward to a plank pose for arm and core strength. Body in a straight line and hold. Three to six slow deep breaths. So lift the thighs up, press the heels back. Spread the fingers, breathing. When you come out, knees down. Big toes touch, child's pose. Okay, down dog, come up to all fours, curl the toes under, lift the hips. Extend the spine, hold and breathe. This pose stretches the back and legs, strengthens the arms. And always, with slow breathing in yoga, it can relax the mind. When you come out, knees down, child's pose, and relax. Okay, now we'll try one more posture for your quick yoga break. Interlock the fingers with the forearms on the ground, elbows under shoulders. Curl the toes under and lift the hips. Dolphin, hold and breathe. It's like down dog, but your forearms are on the ground. Optional, one-legged dolphin. Lift one leg up and hold. And switch. And release, knees down. Child's pose, balasana. This time, if you are comfortable, back of hand on the ground, curl in a ball and relax. to come out, roll the spine up, and that's all it is. Take a little yoga break by getting up from your desk. If not, you can even practice in a chair, and move your body, breathe. It's good for the mind and body. I wanted to share this quick little few minute break, and I'm about to teach a weekly class for a company that we're now doing remote live classes instead of in person. So, um, if any company does want yoga, they can contact me on sunlightyoga.com. And I have also seven online yoga courses on my website already. Um, with self-paced, you can go at your own pace. But enjoy these live breaks.